Nebuchadnezzar's Dream, Part 2, King James Version. Wherefore, O King, let my counsel be acceptable unto thee, and break off thy sins by righteousness, and thy iniquities by showing mercy to the poor. If it may be a lengthening of thy tranquility, all these came upon the king Nebuchadnezzar. At the end of twelve months, he walked in the palace of the kingdom of Babylon. The king spake and said, Is not this great Babylon that I have built for the house of the kingdom by the might of my power and for the honor of my majesty? While the words was in the king's mouth, there fell a voice from heaven, saying, O King Nebuchadnezzar, to thee it is spoken. The kingdom is departed from thee, and they shall drive thee from man, and thy dwelling shall be with the bits of the field. They shall make thee to eat grass as oxen, and a seven times shall pass over thee, until thou know that the Most High ruleth in the kingdom of man, and giveth in to the whomsoever he will. The same hour was the thing fulfilled upon Nebuchadnezzar, and he was driven from man, and did eat grass as oxen, and his body was wet with the dew of heaven, till his hairs were grown like eagles' feathers, and his nails like birds' claws. And at the end of the days, I, Nebuchadnezzar, lifted up my eyes unto heaven, and my understanding returned unto me, and I blessed the Most High, and I praised and honored him that liveth for ever, whose dominion is an everlasting dominion, and his kingdom is from generation to generation. And all the inhabitants of the earth are reputed as nothing. And he doeth according to his will in the army of heaven and among the inhabited titans of the earth. And none can stay his hand or say unto him, What doest thou? At the same time, my reason returned unto me, and for the glory of my kingdom, my honor and the brightness returned unto me, and my counselors and my lords sought unto me, and I was established in my kingdom, and excellent majesty was added unto me. Now I, Nebuchadnezzar, praise and extol and honor the King of Heaven, all whose works are truth, and his ways judgment, and those that walk in pride, he is able to abase. That's it. Thank you. God bless you.